A continuation review of the Jerry 31s and their construction. So the construction of the Jerry 31s or J 31s for short by Infrared or IRay kind of just depends on how you look at it. The quality, very good. I'm very impressed. Um, other dual tubes, I'd say, are relatively on par with this, um, in the sense that this isn't better or worse than those. The feel, the function is there. I, I'm not missing anything as far as the construction goes. The mount fits properly into both a Wilcox or one of your more generic models. And then you have your IR right here on board. And then you have your on switch. You just press it and it turns on. Um, or sorry, the illuminator turns on when you press it and hold it. And then if you turn it on like this, then it turns on the actual tubes inside. So quick introduction to that you'll see them light up if there was a battery and you'd be able to see through the tubes. A little fun fact too, when you look at the tips right here, you'll notice these are pinholes. On night vision, if you're familiar with night vision at the very least, you'll know that those kind of just help with you being able to focus on everything all at once. With the way these are, when you look through these and they're powered on, you're able to see without an issue. And even with this pinhole covering it. I'll get you a video here in a bit and, you know, in the next one or two days, we'll have a video showing how this looks with the battery in it, just so it makes sense what I'm talking about now.